What's up guys, Tipati Percy here and welcome back to a new video about Blue Protocol. And yes, it is about the next beta test. I wouldn't call it the next CBT, I would rather call it the stress test, you will see why soon. But in this video, I will go through the recent infos we got from the new website. So they updated their website and that's where we got all those new infos. And then I will also go through fast how to create an account or where you can find links about how to create an account and how to apply for the next beta. So let's get started. As you can see in the background, the article was just made a few minutes ago and um, I just wanted to deliver the information as soon as possible to you guys so that you can make an account and apply for the next stress test. I will provide all the important links which I'm going to show you in this video down below in the video description. So don't worry, just check it out there and go to the website later. We will use the Blue Protocol database website because uh, you don't have to go to the main website or the Japanese website and translate it because those guys did already do the job. I was sleeping while the other admins were doing this job and actually made the article happening. So great job Mango and Nier. Now let's move on. First of all, those two paragraphs are the most important paragraphs about the closed beta test. Once again, I would rather call it the stress test. And there will be only 15,000 people allowed to play. This is way less than the last CBT. This is why I would once again call it a stress test because it's all about one particular thing, which is matchmaking. I will explain it later though. The application period of the phase will last from today until 26th of October and on November 7th we will be able to play the game if you are one of the lucky ones who got selected. So if there are more than 15,000 people applying for the CBT they will make a lottery. The CBT will only last for a few hours, once again stress test, and it will be focused on matchmaking. That is why everyone who is allowed or lucky enough to play the game during the stress test will be automatically level 25. And there will be a specific matchmaking system to do specific contents. And of course, before you guys ask the same question in the comment again, yes, you need a VPN because only Japanese people are allowed to play. So even for registering an account and applying for the CBT, everything which has to do with Blue Protocol you should use a VPN with the Japanese IP. Some additional infos which I want to share with you guys based on the experience we made in the last few CBTs. Don't make more than three accounts. At the end of the day, 99% of the people and the accounts they made, if they made more than three accounts, all got banned or their access, even if they got access initially, they will recheck it their access got revoked. So make sure that you don't apply with too many accounts. I would say two or three is enough, but don't go overboard. So now that you know it, how do you get an account? Simple. You go to the database website again, and there is a link here in guides, close beta, and how to create a Banda Namco ID. That's where you have a step-by-step -step guide about how to create an account. While you are scrolling through the guide, pay attention to point 2.3 because you have to have here Japan as your residence. If you choose anything else, you won't be able to participate or apply for the CBT. Once you went through the entire guide and made an account and of course have a VPN active while you're doing it, you can go back to the main article and click on this link. I'm pretty sure the admins or Nier is currently working on um, adding the, all the required links to the same article so that you don't have to search for it but once you click on this link you will be redirected to this website all you have to do is scroll all the way down and make sure you make a tick here and here and i assume you already made an account by following the other guide and so you just need to click on login with the bandai namco id and it will ask you to log in into your account which should be easy and then after that you will get an email and a pop-up message on screen which will say something like you applied for the next CBT test. So we are at the end of this video, some fast infos before we end it today, um, which is the schedule, you can see it here again, and application conditions, one of the most important ones that you live in Japan, which is why VPN is required. And uh, of course, if you already had access to the previous test, 
that doesn't mean you will have automatically access also to the current test. I already tried with my alpha and beta account, which both had uh, access. None of them have access for the current or the next CBT. So I had to reapply again. So if you were one of the lucky ones, you have to reapply again and hope to be lucky again. So I would recommend you guys to go through this stuff fast and so you can see here also a more in detail test schedule for the CBT day or the stress test day. There will be different contents which you can go through. You can even match make with your friends so you don't have to match make always with um, random. So if you are lucky or if you want to play with some English people, you can join the database discord and try to find people who are lucky like you and then just match make with them. And as you know, a blue protocol has a unique class system with the same character. You can play all the classes. You will level them up individually. But for this stress test, your character will have all the classes maxed out at level 25 or actually the max level for that particular stress test. You will be also provided with skill points, some weapons, some lunar and glory coins, which are the currencies. You can find a bunch of guides on the website or in the database website about those currencies and about battle imagine. So if you don't know what battle imagines are, you can find a guide here about those imagines somewhere here. Yeah, let's see. Imagine. This part is only important for you guys if you're one of the selected ones. There are small, very basic guides about how to match make, about the coins and um, classes and weapons. You will find more detailed information, of course, on the website. And last but not least, you have some FAQ about um, beta tests or the stress test. Make sure you follow it if you have a few questions. Some of them might be answered here. But if you have any other questions left, feel free to ask in the comments and I will try to help you out or just join the Blue Protocol database discord, which will be also linked down below in the video description. Other than that, have a nice day, guys. See ya. Bye bye. Your Tea Party Percy.